Welcome everybody back to the channel where we are moving on from that other uh, one where we're having the motor problems. And we got a pretty much gutted, looks like Grand Caravan. And we're going to pimp this ride out. So we're going to, first we're going to wash it. clean the interior. I don't know if it ever usually does anything. I never, I can never tell if it actually makes a difference. Uh, we're going to drop it back on the hoist. We got no motor for this thing, so uh, let's check it out. What can we put in for a motor? A V8 double overhead cam supercharged. V8 double overhead cam supercharged. V8? Before I do this, um, yep, V8. Oh, this thing's gonna be insane. V8. Double overhead. Supercharged. Didn't we make one of these? Ooh, a 4x4. Four four. Alright, let's uh, slap that down. Glad we got some extra parts laying around. Except for, of course, we don't have that. Or that, really? Alright, let's grab some parts. I'm quite sure we had some of them. I did get that error again pop up when I jumped into the game, so I wonder if it uh, got rid of some of our stock that we had. Piston rings, eh? Okay. Right, let's get some piston rings going. ones I need. I'm just gonna order a bunch of each of them. Are we out of pistons? No. But we are now. <clears throat> A lot of our inventory got deleted or something. Uh, tuning engine heads. <clears throat> 
that down. down interesting I like how we don't have a bunch of rockers to put on that's just tedious I'll grab those parts Exhaust manifold. Coils. Oh, but they're not. Uh... <clears throat> they're not the uh, high performance ones, are they? Let's throw this on. Throw the ignition coils on. down here, we'll put this stuff on. Alright, throw on a beefier throttle body and get the rest of these ignition coils in. Oh, belt tensioner. And a serpentine belt. I wish there was sort of a quicker way to order some of the stuff. See if it'll uh, go in, or do we have the curse? 
of the uh, of the engine stand. It won't let me put motors into anything. Uh, we gotta get rid of that exhaust. I know that's gonna hamper us. So we'll go ahead and do that. <coughs> it up a bit more here. Uh, the part mount? No, I don't want a part mount. I want to actually take the part off. And then we'll go ahead and lower this back in. And where's my engine stand? It's over here. I'm going to move it to A. Install. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. <clears throat> is this another modded vehicle or is this game just busted for me? Little equipment. Install. Yep, game is busted. At least these, uh. This might be a modded vehicle. Let's go. Move this car. Oh, sad. And we're going to we're gonna go find a yeah. We'll go to the junkyard. Actually, instead of a barn find, we'll see what's at the junkyard that we can pick up. Alright, so, I decided to go to a barn instead because the junkyard just has parts. Uh, or at least that was my experience. This is a nice looking car. I've done a Thunderbird. I'm going to do another one. I'm leaning towards this one, but let's see what's back here. Would this be like some kind of Plymouth? Oh, it's got like a cobra snake looking thing. We're gonna buy the car. Oh, it's a, well, it's just a Ford Mustang. Oh, it says car mod though. I am not doing a car mod. Uh, I guess we're gonna do this one. Or actually, let's go to a different bar. See what we can find. Alright, what do we got here? Is this another car mod? Nope. Because the mods seem to be broken. Is this a mod? It probably is. Okay, it's not. We're gonna take this one. How do I buy it? Go to look, put it in the garage, and then we'll go home. All right. So looking at the Salem Spectra, we can buy a hood with a hole in the middle. So let's see if we can't. Let's see if we can wash it. And then that motor we made a couple episodes ago. Let's see if it'll fit in this. the interior cleaner. Is this not it? There we go. Oh, it shines up really good, man. Not bad at all. Uh, move the car onto lift A. <coughs> and we'll move the crane. motor. Use the engine crane. Oh, okay. So we'll go ahead and get this dr 
drive shaft removed. It's got no starter, so we're off to a good start. We don't need to deal with that. And then probably, yeah, we're gonna have to remove that exhaust piece. Now we should be able to pull a motor. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, it's telling me to drain the oil. Well, just, just used to just charge you. I'll do it. I'll do it. I feel like that wasn't wasn't much oil at all in there, but. <clears throat> install this beast. Throw that back in there. Oh. Uh, we'll pretend like we didn't do that. And we're going to take off that hood. And we're going to put on this fast, or this, uh, this one. Ooh, I like the black hood with the, uh, the rest of the car. So, let's see if there's any welding that needs to be done. Oh, we got an interior detailing kit here. Nice. Uh, see if there's any welding we got to do. Yes, there is. We'll fix the body up. Any defects? Make sure it's all spit and shine and in good shape. I'm going to tear apart the uh, suspension. And then I'll be back and we'll get some new parts and put her all back together like new. Actually, I don't know. Maybe you'll want to see this part. So I'm going to walk by you. You can watch me do this part. Should we change the wheels up? Or leave them? Have you guys ever rebuilt a car? What's your favorite part of doing it? Are you working on something now? Let me know in the comments down below. Personally, I'm not. I don't have the time or the money. Let's go back to the back here. Now 
we got all that done. Let's take off the all the little body parts. in a door, okay. I'm not sure if we're gonna use the same tail lights or what. What do you guys think we should do? Uh, let's see, interior. Take out the front grill. So we'll, now that we got the car stripped down, we'll go down and see what kind of parts we can repair. All right. Oh, was there something else I can repair? Oh, perfect. to repair okay no parts to repair so now oh I missed a fender and that hood's brand new so we're good there so now our job I mean I know it wouldn't happen this quick but uh, now our job we're gonna throw everything back on car is this? This is the Salem Spectra Fastback. So, different tail lights. Um, I do like this. these headlights. I think we will go with those tail lights. Other than that, it's, uh, it's all going to be the same. Because there's no other other options. That's okay. Kind of like the old ones, to be honest with you. Yeah. I like the old ones better. Stick with that. We have a spare one. Interesting. Okay. Um, I don't have a door. Very good. I do like the modernized headlight. So we're going to change that out. Considering all that, let's take this baby to the paint shop and do it up real nice. So I've been toying around with some colors and stuff and I'm thinking this is the one. So we'll paint that. <laughs> I love how it's on blocks. <laughs> Throw that back in the car, lift, and I'm going to go ahead and get a suspension under this thing. Alright, so, going with a modified exhaust, uh, we I've decided to go with a modified gearbox, a little, just a little bit more torque. We have a starter. Oh yeah, nice. Look at this nice, gorgeous exhaust. Man, 
It's a beauty. Get some leaf sprain U bolts bolted in here. The only thing I'm not sure what to do yet is what we're going to do for rims and tires. Definitely thinking some nice sport looking style stuff. Since we've got the hood scoop and everything going for us. Do we have a fuel pump? No, we do not. Okay. A fuel pump. It's not under tune up bots. There we go. I don't know what category I was under before, but. The wrong one, I guess. Oh, let's put on some. Finish putting this leaf spring in before we forget. Why aren't you letting me select? There we go. Camera angles here. All right. Oh, I missed a missed some parts there, didn't I? A little crucial to have that, I think. So we got dual pipes down the middle. Let's bring this down. Let's get the interior put back together. Uh, here we go. Uh, to assemble. Um, yeah, we're going to go with this wheel. Shoot, which, <laughs> which, which seat was it? I think it, seat Wildcat? Was either that or seat five leather D? No, it wasn't that. I don't think. Well, now it's showing me this one. It is showing me that one. Oh, it's the last part I put in. That's all. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yes, wheels and tires. Wheels and tires. Is all this good to go? Put that down. Really, I don't have a... Servo. Yeah. I'm surprised I don't have most of these parts. Just spare stock and stuff. Parts, reservoir. steering fluid into her. Get some washer fluid got going. She's pretty empty. I mean, makes sense, right? Cool. 
all topped off. I don't think there was a coolant reservoir, was there? when you want to stop. Bad day without brake fluid. Throw some motor oil in. Top quality as I'm sure. In this kind of motor I would. For how much we've invested in this car. Let's figure out some wheels here. We do get some wheels. Uh, we got uh, these, but we also got these. I think they would look nice, but they're rough shape, but rough looking. So I think we'll fix them up. Uh, let's see if we can't. Oh. oh, we broke it. Oh no, we broke it again. Oh shoot. Rim Atlanta 15. All right. Is that the kind of rims and tires we want on this thing? Some of these tires, I kind of like this one here. I think we're gonna go. It's supposed to be uh, 225. Oh shoot! What size is where is that? 225, 60, 15. We'll get four of them, and then we're gonna mount them. Nope, not on this one. My bad. This one, oh, we got some busted up ones though. And we can't fix them, right? They're busted, busted. Yep. So I need to buy some of them too. Now you're just finishing up with the last one. These look like they're gonna be bangers. Oh my god, yeah, look at Gonna be a sweet looking ride, man. Whoops. Oh, better put that part on. sure everything's lined up correctly. All the toes and cavers. Perfect. And then we can do the headlights if we want, I guess. Oh, baby, that 
that thing looks mint. Oh my god, seriously. Uh, yeah, let's take it to the dyno. See what kind of power she makes. Rear shock absorber. Oh. <clears throat> Slightly important. Alright, let's see what this baby will do. Thanks for watching as always. Take care and stay safe.